Okay, still haven't found the thing for this. Uh, might just have to deal without it. But anyways, I was gonna be. Oh, and if you hear noise, that's my electric tea kettle thingy heating water up for instant coffee. But I was gonna be a little bit lighthearted, make fun of things because I lit serious topics now for a while and stick everything begins with E. Yeah, yesterday was entitlement and tomorrow I'm gonna do exploitation for my pet peeve. But today which is related to entitlement, expectations. Xena and Buffy spoiled me because when a show has a musical episode, I expect some of the cast can actually sing and there will be original music. Now, I, I don't care for Grey's Anatomy, but my mother loved it and the, I was so disappointed that the musical episode was basically just karaoke lip syncing. There was no original anything. It was horrible. That's me. So yeah, I'm a spoiled, I'm a spoiled brat when it comes to that kind of thing. But that was my all I was gonna say for my pet peeve. But then, yeah, it's just now my pet peeve is myself because we had someone at church today who the only time they're at church is when they have issues, which doesn't on itself doesn't sound bad because of course you if you have issues go to church, but. Um, I gotta be careful what I say because I don't want to say too much. I'm just going to say their issues require medication and they tend to only come to church when they're not on medication. And I find it hard to respond properly to that person. I don't know why I'm so upset. If it, like, they do need help. They do need help. They just have trouble staying with their help and taking the medication. And, like I said, my issue, yeah, I am not, I don't know why I'm so offended by that and how the what the proper response right because a lot trying to talk to them I, I don't know if that's if they understand if they're processing and listening to them it I don't know if they're telling the truth or they're, what's going on. And I, my pet peeve is, like I said, I'm mad at myself because I need to be more loving. We were, you know, and the topic of Sunday school today, you know, was about how sin starts in the heart. And I need... Yeah, I'm not, I know my attitude towards that person is not where it needs to be. And so yeah, it's not there. And this is a me problem. This is not, they're not a problem in this situation to me, I am. And I don't know what to do. And as my blessings, Hot pocket for lunch. That's all I'm going to say because this is getting too long because, like I said, there's, yeah, this is just told me every time I see him because the only time they're really out in the public is when there's a problem. And I, this is me. And again, they have problems, but in this situation, I am the problem. My attitude is a problem and I don't know what to do. And I hope everyone's having a blessed day.